Hey guys, in this video I'm going over how to lower high prolactin levels naturally, okay? So stay till the end because I will give you one special hack, okay? So uh, prolactin already, as you know, can really contribute to erectile dysfunction and can really work against your testosterone. Uh, probably more than estrogen, okay? So it's really good to lower prolactin. Uh, I see uh, high prolactin in men on TRT, and also I see prolactin from also from different sources like low dopamine level or serotonin overload, okay? So in this video, I give you one special hack how to lower prolactin naturally, okay? So I'm not a big fan of things like cabergoline and uh, other other uh, dopaminergic drugs because they can, at the end, they can lower your baseline dopamine, okay? So I think I already had some video on uh, how dopamine works against prolactin and how prolactin works against dopamine. So you can do it that way, okay, so that you will uh, increase dopamine and it will work against uh, prolactin, but this is only one part of the equation. And in this video, I will give you a second part, okay? So, what many people don't know, there is something called uh, estrogen-induced prolactin release, okay? So, high estrogen can really trigger uh, prolactin to increase from pituitary, okay, or, or hypothalamus, okay. So, uh, if you have a high estrogen, uh, I see it in many guys on TRT, that can cause high prolactin. And uh, also the second thing is, that it's also sometimes connected with higher estrogen or estradiol on your blood test, is serotonin okay so fixing these two can really get your prolactin down okay so uh, you don't need uh, high prolactin in your body okay even if you drop it to like seven or five it's okay okay so if your prolactin is over like 10 or 15 you would likely to get it down to at least seven okay so it's also really great for your sexual health and it's also really great for increasing testosterone okay and how will you do it okay so you need to stop this estrogen induced prolactin release and there is wonderful adaptogen i have you several adaptogen from russia and this one is called shisandra okay and Shisandra, if you know how you can dose it and how you can cycle it, can have a really great effect on this estrogen-induced prolactin release, okay? So it can have a great impact on your prolactin level, uh, stopping it from, uh, from release, okay? So Shisandra can have a great impact on on uh, the estrogen uh, induced prolactin release okay shisandra is also used uh, by athletes to induce uh, endurance performance and all these kind of things it's great adaptogen okay uh, but has also great benefits for decreasing prolactin that is caused by high estradiol okay so this is one thing and the second thing would be to decrease your serotonin levels especially if your gut is inflamed your serotonin will be hot so fixing your gut inflammation can also be great things to bring your prolactin down okay so if you more, want more videos similar to this let me know in the comment and if you need my help you will find also links for my coaching have a great day bye guys